the Federal House of Rep, Honorable Baba Jimmy Benson, who is representing Ikorodu constituency at the Federal House of Assembly, has done yet another mega empowerment to the good people of Ikorodu constituency. The empowerment took place at his constituency office along Ebute Igbogbo Road, Ikorodu, on 20th of August 2022. At this year's empowerment program, Honorable Baba Jimmy Benson distributed 30 minibus, 25 kekena pep, 9 tricycles, 70 freezers, 45 generator, 15 organizer machine, 40 hair drying machine, 43 sewing machine, and 3,000 solar power lights to the good people of Ikorodu constituency. <laughs> During his speech at the event, Honorable Baba Jimmy Benson noted that he has facilitated over 30 roads across Ikorodu Division and the construction of 80 beds hospital in Namata, among various empowerment programs to Ikorodu citizens. So, apart from that radio station, another great thing, Timoshi Timolai, Timogorashi, he further stated that in the first quarter of 2023, other roads will be implemented and completed, and a large stadium will be built in Laspotec, now known as Lasutec, in Ikorodu. Then you are not here by next week, Amabere Ajose Road in Ibeshi. At the empowerment program, Honorable Baba Jimmy Benson also called for genuine reconciliation between party faithfuls addressing the issues of Lagos State House of Assembly Ikorodu Constituency 1 and Ikorodu Constituency 2 in order to enable peaceful working environment in Ikorodu and for more community development so that the good people of Ikorodu Division can enjoy the dividends of democracy. <laughs> I lose the primaries, have you? I'm about to lose the primaries. The time substitution, the door, the time we draw out the door, the alliance do out the way, everybody tip the way. Auto cash is in me. Auto cash is in me. Alpha boy. Oh, that don't pay for it. I want to see reconciliation. I want to have any any to win. Oh, pass. Oh, more reconciliation. She. Daddy. Oh, she. The picture is in me. Daddy. Could they have gone in bed? Daddy. Maybe I just go now. I'm sorry about that, Daddy.
Ama Papola or Ama Tutime, who can you hundred thousand? Hundred thousand. Our constituency, too, no. Ama Wabashima to everybody, no. Ama, me, okay, Mami, go, I believe, go, I mean, I know. Ama Wabashima, Yama, Bashima, be a remedy, Motimo, Sulaja, Bashima, Wabi, Bashima, she is in speaking with Chilean TV correspondent, House of Representative Etiosa Ibrahim Babajide Obanikuru was marvel about the impact and community development in Ikurudu. Well, I was honestly not expecting anything. Um, anything less that's why i was motivated to come down here to witness what he is doing and um, i know him to be a righteous uh, individual so i am not uh, i'm not surprised I'm, I'm i'm happy for the people of the Gorodu constituency uh what am i taking home the ovation i've learned one or two things that i'll definitely emulate in my own empowerment as well prince larry sanusi member house of representative candidates amu Odofi, also have this to say. For my emergence to be the candidate to represent the good people of Amor of the Federal Constituency, it will all go along. Titi Wo, Ati Ta Wo To Ku No, Eba Le Kidaru. On behalf of my family, my beloved wife, Dr. Mrs. Laura, and my dear children, I want to say a very big thank you. Honorable, thank you so much. Thank you for all that you do and all that you continue to do. I want you alone with your career partner, Taro Olowo. Hope you are not only a D, Sawolu, Sawolu. Thank you so much, the D, the DG. I see all members of IKT. team. If you know I care in the meal, I'm also part of you. And I'm, I'm thinking from some of the things that you're doing here. And by the struggles of God, with that of what we have in plan. I'm a replicator. I'm a replicator. I'm a replicator already. I'm a replicator. I'm a replicator. I'm a replicator. So I said, I mean, these are many more. <coughs> but I'm so excited uh, for my honorable. Lapa alone. All of my food, my friendship. Which is my journey here. One of the team member of iCare, Mr. Regbe, spoke to Chalian TV about this year's empowerment i can say it has been very much it has been marvelous uh, basically that uh, we are able to put smiles on face of people a lot of people are here being able to benefit from uh, different items that can assist them in their various endeavors i believe uh, they will they will add value to what they are doing presently uh, we see huge crowd you know we are used to that and we've been doing that over the years. This is not just the first time we'll be doing this. So we are accustomed to being able to manage this kind of crowd. So it's not new to us. I, I can just wish them all the best. Thank you. The dignitaries presence and some of the beneficiaries spoke with Chilean TV correspondents, and this is what they said. Uh, I am not surprised with what we are seeing here today. This is not the first time. It's a continuous exercise. And I believe that this is just the beginning of more of good things to come from Honorable Baba University. He has been doing it. We should expect more. We are expecting more. Now, talking about the hospital that um, our father is building, jokingly, 
Yesterday he said, come and carry it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. But deep down inside your heart, sir, you are full of joy. What's going to about that? Yeah. You see? God will continue to bless you and provide you with What you are going to do with him, but I see The hospital is the biggest in the whole of the Kurodu division. We are so happy. But like you mentioned earlier, as an Oliver Twist, I told him that we don't want the hospital again. You should come and carry it. Because Baba Jimmy Benson has touched the other since local governments in the Korodu when it comes to road construction. And he has not done anything in the matter when it comes to road construction. That is why I said we don't need the hospital again. If it is possible for him to move the hospital somewhere, he can do so. To West. That we need roads. We have roads in the water, but we need Baba Jimmy Benson roads in the water. So he can come and we don't need the hospital again. He can come and carry it and give it to him. Do not or west. It's the road. It's the road. That's what we need. Uh, well, my advice to my people here who are who benefited from this uh, empowerment program that they should go and woo more people. To come and follow us in APC, to come and join APC, to vote for all our candidates in the coming election because we are the best. We can see this. We have never experienced anything like this in the world, ever, except what Baba Jimmy Best has been doing. We have never experienced this type of empowerment, this type of enjoyment and upliftment. So we are telling them to go and work harder so that they can continue to enjoy uh, this type of uh, programs to continue. They should go to all our country, from Ashwaju to Governor Sawuji, the Senator Abiru, Baba Jimin Benson himself, then our assembly, the two assembly in the constituency, one and constitution in the it should force for them massively. So that this can be enlarged, we can continue to benefit more. Okay, so how do you feel receiving this as one of the beneficiaries? I'm so happy receiving this. It makes me feel happy and good. Were you expecting it? Not really, I wasn't expecting it. It just came as a surprise. So what's your word of thanks to our Honorable Baba Jimmy really, I would say a big thank you to him for the great work and the good work he's been doing. And God will continue to help him and bless him. Um, seeing tears of joy right now and um, your steadfastness in the political part of APC, uh, getting this wonderful gift, what's your expression like? I'm speechless. I am just speechless. I really can't. I'm out of I'm out of words. I have been molested. I've been insulted. I've lost everything. But thank God for Honorable Bajime Benson and my political boss, Honorable Jokumba. I can never forget him. Thank God, and I thank them. Right now, I am short of words. Sincerely. Oh well, I must say. A big thanks to God Almighty for giving us an outstanding performer, the members of Reps, Honorable Baba Jimmy Adego K. Benson, and for helping him achieve this. This is a this this is this is beyond words. This is history in the making, you know. This is beyond his own personal ambition. It's it's sweet seeing this. I feel so happy. Um, doing that is a lifestyle. Yeah, even before um, politics, it's been a lifestyle. Um, the first water projects that we 
we are fixing in Ijomu right now. It's going to be launched on my birthday. And we are starting the second one on that birthday. So every quarter of the year, we have two to three community development projects for the next four years. So how do you feel that I'm going to do this? I'm going to do this. First and foremost, I would like to say a big thank you to Honorable Baba Jimmy Benson on behalf of the good people of the Corona. Uh, this is so inspiring. This is awesome. And this is representative par excellence. You see, the electorate need nothing far fetched from their representatives other than feedback, adequate representation, capacity building, individual de development. We know the stage at which we are in the country. But when you are up and you feel it necessary and imperative to lift others up, I believe uh, the society will be better for it. So it is a shining light of good leadership. It is a shining light of what representation should be all about. So I want to give him kudos. I want to wish him the best. And I believe, uh, just like he said, to whom much is given, much is expected. The good people of Ikorodu have so much confidence. They have reposed so much confidence and in Jimmy, Baba Jimmy Benson. And as God be the glory, he has not been found wanting. All right, so the beneficiaries of today's Yeah, well, uh, I would just want to urge them, advise them to make good use of whatever that has been given to them. Oh, yeah. Manners don't go far oh, from yeah. heaven. You, oh, yeah. you work for your daily bread. So oh, I yeah. want to implore them. I want to encourage oh, yeah. them. Little drops of water oh, makes a mighty ocean. Oh, yeah. For whatever they've oh, yeah. got in today, they should know oh, yeah. they are just privileged. Oh, yeah. The few privileged are oh, the citizens. So they should make judicious use of whatever they've been have. It is all about empowerment. It's all about having positive impact on their lives, on their living standard. So they should work towards that. Nothing is too small to make a better society, to make a better living. So I wish them the very best. I'm Dada Gipel Olusheson, former vice chairman in Korodu, Thank you. Yeah, talking about um, what our Honorable Babajimi Benson Today, oh, yeah. Happens to be the second day. Well, uh, as it is, uh, when you have a representative that knows what it takes, you know, to represent his people, you have to cut across everything. You know, if you look at him, he's good with his primary assignment, which is making laws. You know, that's legislative work, which have, which has to do with motions, bills, and all that. But what you are experiencing here today. It's something that is being fused to the more representative, making sure your people have the direct benefit of democracy. You know, what we have here is empowering our people, trying to make them understand the fact that the representative is not just looking out for law that will make their, their constituency so better, but also looking at things that will come as a form of relief. And whether we like it or not, the economic situation in Nigeria today, not just Nigeria, as a whole, Africa as a whole, is getting it up. So all this stuff that you see can be a form of startup to some set of people. It can be a form of startup to some set of and also a going consign to some set of you that are already into business. Like some who are parting with, with Frieza and all that can add it to their businesses. Why some who are getting the mini buses can start a transport business. Same goes for the people getting the keke na pep and all that. And for those who have solar, even if you are petty traders, you know, you can light up your environment at least to sell. If you are closing your stores and all that, by six, seven, now you can still push it to eight, nine. We can improve the sales. And generally, it's a very good atmosphere. And one major thing I appreciate most is this thing is getting to the hands of people who really need it, which is very, very important. And I can only pray for Jimmy Benson that you can only get better. And I want every legislative, every politician, every political officer that to emulate such things. 
they need to work in the line of making things better for their people and their constituencies. Yes. All right, talking about making things better for their constituency yeah. and uh, people, Honorable Babajimi Ness indeed say that he did. He has done 30 roads so far and he's still doing more. Mm. Is that a surprise or an impactful, you know, um, community development? Well, the word surprise is synonymous to the way he has been operating. When I say synonymous, fine, it is the role of government. It's the role of people in government. It's the role of us to do this. But when you see people who are exceptional in carrying out their duties, we always get to be surprised because the truth remains when you do something spectacular people will be surprised looking at the fact that he is not the first to represent us at that level but now he is standing out in that way so that the first the first thing remain we will be surprised and will continue to be surprised how do you feel receiving this from honorable jb i'm thank god from honorable jimmy benson because what this man has doing in the korodu in my own life when I was doing my naming, it's best that I pay my when I do naming, pay my money. I will come on the you. It's the best that I pay. When I'm doing them, politics, the person that say compensate me as a something like this. I've never received something in the politics. I'm an ESCO welfare officer in go do West what be. I'm a thank God for honorable Jimmy Benson. And I pray for God for him. God should make him as a governor in Lagos State, not ordinary as of rep. My name is Bade Aboriota from Wadi Gorodu West. I mean, yeah, yeah, Shaki Rat, Rat Imota. You know, me drew a few new people for full party and Jimmy Ben Sitoche from Wadi Gorodu West. I took a man on I do not want to go to the house. I do not want to go to the house. I do not want to go to the house. I do not go to the house. For making him reminding us, and we we appreciate him very well. He has been done well here in the Kuru Division since he has come as the MHR for the Kuru Division, and we still pray for his better and higher level data. We pray that next time he will become a senator from senator to the first civilian governor produced by the Kuru Division by the Special Grace of God. In attendance were traditional rulers Oba Kabil Shotobi, a young brother of Ikurudu, Oba Adeboruwa, who led other traditional rulers, political leaders, inclusive of member Honorable Sulaiman Kazim, Chairman Ikurudu West, Builder Deola Banjo, Chairman Ikurudu North, Honorable Motorayo Alogba, Chairman Ijede, LGA, Chairman in Ikurudu Division, Ward Chairman in Ikurudu Division, Ward Councillors, CDC Chairman, and host of Party Faithfuls were all present at this year's Empowerment Program. Italian TV News. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. Italian TV.